But it's not something that's a kind of an SNL academy today. I just want to dive in on affordability. Ne? Uh, we all know that in order for you to afford certain things, you must have a score, a score. Also, very important if you've never worked before, you've never had any debt, then you cannot qualify for any debt. Like, let's say you want to buy a car, they will tell you uh, first you need maybe to have an account in your own, of a clothing account, or you must take a cell phone contract, and then they must have like a track record as to can you pay on a monthly basis, can you be consistent, can you be trusted basically. Right? Now, the thing is, but for you too. Uh, the system that they actually use, this is my personal uh, opinion and also it's not financial advice and also it's based on my personal research of which I always take as an adult of the sound mind, you have a responsibility to go out there, do your research, you have access to the internet otherwise. So now, the system learner, they will tell you, you can afford this car because you can or because you, you, are, you are getting paid so much of money. And then now, uh, you will find people going to take car finance, né? which will take 40% or 40% plus of their salaries. Meaning, you are earning 10,000 rand a month. Now, you go take a car that will make you pay 6,000 rand. That is, guys, 60% of your salary. Mind you, in tea, 40% already, that is high, guys. 40% of your salary. So everyone there who's paying for a car, only car finance, just go and calculate how much is your monthly installment. And also do bear in mind, you still have a track. You still have an insurance. And the younger, the younger you are, the more you're going to pay because as we're saying, you are still reckless. And also, your location, which are like us, by as a class, which is with me, PTPs. They know pothole stories, they know who give you your crime, they know robots. Like, they, they are forever or, or forever almost dead, you know. Unlike here, now we have a situation of ill trading, which is obviously different from the situation as a castle or in the townships. So now what is a guy goes and buy this car brand that's gonna make him pay for seven thousand rand. Then he ends up being in an accident. And um remember with accident he was drunk number one. Number two he was at fault. It wasn't the other driver who was at fault. Now Immortal is going to need 20 or 25,000 rand to be fixed, and that is labor from the guy who's going to fix the car. And then now you still have to buy parts. We all know we can't go for original parts from these car manufacturers because they are expensive. So, obviously, what you're going to do is go try and get a better deal, which will be less than what you will pay from this uh, original part. So that's what he did. So now it's been months, he doesn't have his car. You still have to pay the 7,000. Every month, it is going to support, it doesn't gonna go away, it's still there. On top of that, you need to buy part to get the work going for this guy who is fixing your car. So it's gonna give you a list of parts, so you must just go through it one by one, because obviously, you won't have money to go and buy all these parts at once, yeah, well, in most cases, or in my case, it will be like that. So now, you are literally in depression because of your financial situation. Mind you, you still have to fix that other guy's car. Now, Buffett, this is why it's important to look for stuff that you afford and be realistic with what you can afford because the system they are using is actually not realistic because if he bought a car that's been costing less than what he is currently paying he would have been in a better position than what he is today also fixing the car 
in terms of parts and whatnot, it wouldn't have been the same price as having your creed or an item. You know, I'm not, pro I'm not promoting these cars, I'm not promoting this uh, car brand, they are not paying us, they are not uh, putting money on our channel or anything, but I'm just saying these are cheaper options. And also they are a lot of cheaper options in the market. Do consider that. Yeah? So this thing of when it's going to be a problem because you also need to take those things into consideration. Let's say this car gets in an accident. Will I manage to fix it? Will I have the money to fix this car? So it's fine. They have told you that where you were looking for e car finance. They said, no, it's fine. We see your pay slip. We see your, your track record in terms of how you're paying your debt and everything, your credit score, it's not. But that is not an accurate way to look at your finances. Né? Because you know you have it. You know what you do. You know what you like to do. So now all of those things, you need to bring them into the into that circle and take into consideration what you do you really afford to buy this car and we always tell you guys cars are liabilities because it takes money out of your pocket it doesn't put any money unless you take it you buy a car to put it with uber or taxi fire and in order for it to generate money for you so that is business it's different but for the cars that we're just using to go to and fro and to work then you have to take those things into consideration but this is a liability it's taking money out of your pocket and it cannot be more than 40 percent that is what i'm trying to emphasize on try and make your car installment less than 40 percent of your salary because you cannot be paying so much for a liability something that will be worth way less than what you paid for the past uh, six years because you have to pay it over for six years yeah? Yeah, but otherwise, guys, don't forget to like, subscribe to our channel, and also share our video with the people that you think they might be interested in this information. And also, I would appreciate you to drop a comment and tell me how much is your car installment in terms of percentage, uh, well, according uh, to how much you are earning. Also, I would like to thank you to end, invest, and spend. There's a reason why you have to spend your money after this week investing downward.